Hey, Red Wing fans, Ken Cal for Game Day Preview presented by Comerica Bank. Tonight, the Red Wings shuffle off the Buffalo for a game against the Sabres. The Red Wings dropped a tough 2-1 decision to the St. Louis Blues in their last outing. Detroit is looking for some much needed offense. The Wings recorded 30 shots in their last two games, but managed to score just two goals in those contests. Brendan, everybody's talking about scoring goals. What do the Red Wings have to do to put more pucks in the net? Well, it's hard to score goals, and I think the, the main thing is we got to get more shots, uh, generate more opportunities through uh, shots, and uh, sometimes that uh, when you get shots, it, it creates uh, uh, a cluster and, and then you can find some open nets. So I think that's one of the biggest things is get, uh, make sure we get more pucks to the net and get less attempted blocks. Troy has scored nine regulation goals though against the Sabres this season. Thomas Tatar has seven goals and two assists in his last seven games against Buffalo. Tatar missed the last game against the Blues with the flu. Peter Morazic has made three straight starts and has played in all three games against the Sabres this season. Your, your team has had the sort of crippling blow of losing uh, Drew Miller for the, for the rest of the season. What does that do to your, your penalty kill as you look to get things sorted out? Oh, it's for sure. It's tough. I mean, he's one of our leaders out there, and um, he helps out our penalty kill so much. And, and uh, other aspects of the game, he's always in position, and he's a good shutdown guy, so it, it definitely hurts us. And um, it's sad to see for us, but I think we've got a lot of guys that can step up and, and play that position, and we just kind of got to figure a few things out. Sabres dropped a tough 2-1 decision to the Avalanche in Denver in their last outing. Evander Kane netted Buffalo's lone goal. Kane has five points over his last six games. He's been on fire. Buffalo's penalty kill has been terrific lately. They've killed 15 straight penalties in their last five contests. Tight cap space that if we needed to send him down, um, for example, right now for a defenseman or a goaltender, we could do that. So it's a cap-related issue. Um, that's it. Uh, as, as of tonight and the near future, uh, he, he, certainly as of tonight, he's going to play and he's a Red Wing and uh, we expect him to play well. Puck drop between the Red Wings and the Sabres is at 7 p.m. tonight. You can watch the game on Fox Sports Detroit with Ken Daniels and Mickey Redman or listen on the radio on 97 Won the Ticket with Paul Woods and me. For Comerica Bank Game Day Preview, I'm Ken Cal. Go Wings! Thank you.